What's going on guys, Kirk and Mark here from Motor Gear TV. Thank you guys for tuning in once again. And as you guys can see from the title of the video, we're here at the 2022 staging of Impact here at the legendary Pocono Raceway. We got a lot of cars to see, a lot of people to meet. Not gonna waste any more time. So let's get started. Let's go. Yeah, this is one of those shows where there's literally too much to capture, but we're gonna do our best to just get everything out here. NRP North Valley Performance. Seen these guys before. This G80. I think we saw these at Invasion. Yeah, real nice. And this one as well. It's pretty sick. Right here is a new M240i. You know, this is one of the first sightings that I've seen of this car. Really sick. Nice little carbon pieces inside. And then this one is in the Brooklyn Gray. This one's actually not too bad compared to the purple. Really looking forward to seeing the new M2 when it comes out. But so far, thumbs up for these. And you have this G80. It looks like it's a, well, probably like a satin PPF on it. Yeah. This, this car is what made me fall in love with the M2. This is M2 Ghost, one of the craziest M2s on Instagram. PSM wide body kit. And this one is an OG M2 as well, really sick. Yeah. yeah, really happy that I'm able to see this car in person for the first time. Very nice. We take a look at this brand new X5M. The Dynan package, full carbon intake system. This is really sick. I like the blue as well check it out these are some of the vendors that they have outside just walking around trying to capture as much as we can again trust me there's a lot to take in right now just saw the guys from bmw invasion big ups to you guys again if i see ken i know he's walking around somewhere mark working hard as usual posted yeah man really nice you guys can see that and even this one right here sick 
Hey man. That's a nice, really nice color. Okay. Yeah, it's purple. You guys can see this. Yeah. Triple right, triple right. Got some, uh, some YouTuber fellows. <laughs> What's up, man? Everybody got cars like that. Yeah. YouTube Yeah. Maybe. But see, here's the thing. The problem that I ran into it is... All right, so we're here walking around in the Pocono Raceway, and look who we found. Small all world, the, right? All the way from South Florida. Small world. Yes. Moto Gear TV and also Daily Driven. Absolutely. How, how's the time right now? It's been amazing. Like, if you come to this event, everything you see is BMW enthusiasts, right? But there's a different twist to it because you have roll racing. You hear, like, the amount of engines, turbos, superchargers. And you have some couple Mustangs that are kind of lost here. Yeah. But everything's here, and everybody's having a good time. And what's so good about it? We're all car enthusiasts, but most important, BMW enthusiasts. Yeah. And I see a lot of G80s out here. I'm hoping you're getting a lot of inspiration. I am. Yeah. Uh, my pockets are going to be burning later, but oh, yeah, I man. am. Yeah. You just know everything. I have a mod already that I'm going to hint. It's going to make the car louder. It's coming real soon. There's a little sneak peek. Yeah, real yeah. soon. I heard it today because somebody else has it. It was a developing car. Okay, That's nice. another hint, too. But you guys have to stay tuned for all the updates on Ken's channel. Make sure you guys follow him. Amazing content. Brand new G80. Yeah. Indiv and individual. Emola Red. Emola Red. It makes me not miss my <laughs> F80 M3. Yeah, man. Real talk. But hey, it was always good catching up with them. Absolutely. And he's going to be behind all the B roll. Look at that camera. Look at that camera. Look at that. We brought, we brought, we brought some sauce. We brought some sauce. <laughs> but it's insane here. Yeah, I love it. Capture, he's going to capture a lot of good footage. I know that already. Yeah, I'll catch up with you later, man. All right, brother. All right. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen this G80 on Instagram as well. I really like the combo. You know, like bronze gold wheels, element green. This is a really nice carbon plate for the engine cover. It makes everything look nice and clean. And he paired it with the orange comfort seats. Really nice. I think his IG handle is GAT Zoom. So make sure you guys give him a follow. I've seen this one before. This is, uh, I think it's called Furious M4. I've seen this a couple times. Definitely very unique, definitely stands out. Have a nice clean E36 M3 right here. This looks really good. Very clean, no tints, silver alloy wheels. Very clean interior, beta seats. This is a hurricane print, right? Yeah, it's a nice one. Sick. How long have you had it? Six years. Six years? It's nice, man. <laughs> I realized some Porsche calipers on it. That's pretty cool. That thing is low to the ground, yo. Like, damn. <laughs> yeah, man. A really sick build. G82 M4. All right, so we came to a BMW event, and we know we can't come here without representing for the yard people. So we're here, Rick M Life. So how are you guys enjoying the event so far? Good so far. You guys like the, the GTS on the on the road race? Earlier? Yeah, I lead right now. Yeah? Nice, They're number nice, one right nice. now. Nice. Nice. I remember there was another challenge from our Evo in South Florida as well. Yeah. He's still waiting, apparently. <laughs> Alright, so it's always good for you, you know. Yes, man, big up, big up, big up, big up. Big up everybody. Yeah, man. The E30, the M4, and the X6M. Nice. And the, that's our shop G80 also. That one right there. Oh, yeah, that's the yeah, fast the, one there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So that one is still. Uh, it's not terrible, it's not terrible, everything on this too. So this guy is currently one of the fastest G8s on record right now. Stock turbo, this is just tune and a little bit of sauce from the MLife camp. I'm going to put the time that they did on the screen right now, just so you guys can kind of get an idea. But trust me, this car looks stock right now, but it's no joke. Come on. We're going to be doing a feature on the entire setup when we go to New York. Hopefully that trip should come this year. Um, so you guys are going to definitely have to stay tuned for that. And they also have M4 GTS, also one of the sickest ones on the street. They ran this one earlier and they're currently leading. Trust me, this car, no joke. But as normal, you know, Jamaicans, we have to do it good when it comes to BMW. And trust me, this one is no exception. Now, this is not something you guys see very often. This is, if I believe correctly, BMW CSL, the original old G car. And this one, far from stock. Correct me if I'm wrong. Look like it's on. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is a S50 or S52. Could be. 
but really clean setup titanium everywhere top mount turbo this thing is just amazing in every aspect let me show you what it looks like but yeah man all right and then you guys know that i'm a fan of uni body kits and this one is no exception i forgot the name exactly what this white body kit is i'm gonna put it up on the screen but this is a sick m2 again a little bit too wild for me but i can definitely appreciate it definitely unique and because it's so wide i know that he's probably running a way more aggressive size setup than i am 275 in the front 295 in the back which is basically the same i have on my car but i think he's running a spacer other than that really unique really cool pretty sure he spent a lot of money big up again i'm just gonna walk through and show you guys everything that we see real nice individual green brand new x4m sick amg gts some more g80 fun out here full carbon even tour setup this is really sick and this is at the golden wrench booth you guys should be familiar golden wrench makes these very unique engine caps for your cars another sick car this looks like a m4 cs if i'm not mistaken on the bbs wheels fully custom all carbon engine bay big assortment of golden wrench products csf charge cooler really nice this is golden wrench wound up at Mashimaru booth got to see his car for the first time in the flesh you know, he doesn't really YouTube anymore but it's kind of cool to see this car really sticky 92 apex wheels pretty nice interior everything is pretty custom carbon fiber trunk apex wheels sick Mashimaru you built a really cool car and we definitely got some heat inside these garage bays got RK titanium full assortment of titanium parts sick g80 i'm really liking this titanium shot tower and titanium intakes this is really sick and even the little inserts for the engine cover that's really unique this is what i'm talking about when i say definitely getting a lot of cool inspiration from every angle hopefully they make some parts for my car i'm not sure I definitely have to go and check it out up close in person it looks really good guys trust me i would be lying if i if i told you i wasn't overwhelmed with the amount of different bmws that are here today jesus but every now and then we have to stop and appreciate some of the sick builds like this one right here this is built by straight jacket motorsports 55 transmission got pretty much all off the shelf stuff you could do from ssp basket uh, bill of basket stuff like that other than that completely full custom turbo kit it's a g series 42 1450 nice. um, how much power is this good for we're hoping to make 1400 okay right now just finished two days ago assembling okay the whole car. So, so it's pretty brand new oh, setup she's very brand new yeah, okay, yeah she nice. just started for the first time i think yesterday uh yeah the, the goal is 1400 and we'll nice. get there step by step and as things go on we'll uh sort them out air to water intercooler okay. it's got two garrett 900 horsepower cores built into the intake manifold all that's all custom done by us all the cnc of the rest of the intake manifold nice. uh, on that side this is the pcb setup so we blow the stuff out mm -hmm. that comes down here to a built-in Oh wow. Catch can that's ready to the stock front bumper. Nice. And so where, where's your shop located? Uh, Guilford, Connecticut. Connecticut? Nice. Yes. Really cool setup, really clean. You guys definitely should check them out. Yeah, the front, the back, and all. 
world. So, yeah. It's very interesting seeing the new display mm -hmm. because we saw pictures online and like seeing it in person, like face to face, it actually looks way better in person. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Our good. drivers. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to sleep good tonight. <laughs> so, right? Yeah, keep going right. Yeah, it's not going to get to go too fast. Heading out because everyone's heading out right now. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> okay. nice. Wow, that's pretty fast. Yeah. Right? That's a good one. Was that, was that in sport or a drive? Yeah, that was sport mode. Oh wow. <laughs> Alright, wow. yeah, very consistent. Yeah. Nice. That's very interesting. <laughs> So we just wrapped up test drive in the i4 M50. Pretty cool car, very smooth. I did like the acceleration. The new interface with the brand new touchscreen display is really cool. It looks way better in person, trust me guys. I like how smooth everything is. Control, mobile devices, all of that. If you guys are interested, make sure you guys check it out. Brand new i4, that's all I have to say. Definitely will say this has been a very memorable experience. A lot of things going on. We are starting to roll out right now. We're definitely gonna try and at least enjoy the last few moments of it. But again, it was a very memorable experience. And I can definitely say we'd like to come back again. Just to give you guys an idea, what we covered today is literally just a small portion of the entire show. There was a lot going on on that side. Apparently there's even another parking lot beyond this one. Way too much for us to capture. Just been wanting to keep this video short, simple, to the point. Nice GT3, very sick. Yeah, man. But definitely, for you guys who are big BMW enthusiasts, this is definitely the show to come to. I have no complaints. I'm just going to walk around and capture last minute unique builds that we think stood out to us. So, hope you guys enjoy. Again, you guys know I'm a fan of unique builds. This one is no exception. The BBS wheels. But look at the interior. Tell me that's not sick. <laughs> E92 M3. DSS Supercharge. Nice Fox Red Recaro Sports Seats. And then this one. Java Green Metallic. On the FIRs. Hulk M3. You guys check it out. Recaro Sports Setup. Very sick. Clean build half cage. Nice combination, black, green and gold. Like it. <laughs> M5 CS in the wild, just chilling. Looks a host of other BMWs. This is pretty cool. Till Nike. <laughs> uh, vendors, got Olins out here. Just BMWs left, right and center. Everywhere. Uh, two M2s right here. Competitions. Really clean setup. This is an OG M2, I've seen this one before, it's pretty cool. Nice little front mounts poking out right here. Really clean. Oh yeah man. Yeah, the show is coming to a close impact. We got that merch booth over there. A lot of people are leaving right now. Let's see what else we can find. But this is pretty much honestly, I think we captured maybe like 30-40% of the entire show. It's a whole lot to capture. Pretty cool Vader style looking Z4 over there. That's pretty cool. Definitely wanna walk the rest of the show, see if we can capture some last minute things, and then we're gonna close it out after this. Alright now this is what you call a sick trio. Ah Laguna Seca, E5-6. F80 and E92 all lined up. This is really sick. And they're all modified too. This one has the Gintani boosted supercharger kit. Yeah, man. Really sick. So before we leave, we just had to capture this nice row of M2s. Got one of the owners right here. Yeah, man. On the 88s. Looking really nice. And also M2 Ghost and a host of others. I wish my car was here. Hopefully might be here for the next one definitely would be a cool addition to this nice convoy absolutely man for sure yeah 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 <laughs> yeah we'll have to come to florida and visit you with the for sure for sure yeah man just let me know man absolutely 
All right, and there you guys have it. Another successful event. A lot of cars, a lot of people. I had fun. What about you? Yeah, it was it was it was pretty good. They had a very nice assortment of cars. A lot of G80s, F80s, pretty much everything on the board for M3s and BMWs in general. So I really think it was a pretty good event for the BMW community. Yeah, and I agree. We definitely got a lot of inspiration. I know you got some inspiration for the M3. I got some inspiration yeah. for the M2. So we're going to take these ideas and go back to the drawing board. Definitely enjoyed it for this year. We'll definitely think about coming next year as well. Yeah, overall had a great time. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, make sure you like, share and subscribe. We're going to be doing more content like this in the future. Definitely want to stay tuned for everything we have to come. Thank you guys for tuning in once again. And until then, we're gone.